Hello friends, Karen Cruz here with Two Hearts for Her Counseling and Healing Ministry. I wanted to reach out to you today, first of all, to wish you a very happy Easter. I know we are in sort of unusual times, unprecedented times, we keep hearing over and over again. And you know, so often when we hear that, we hear unprecedented suffering, unprecedented time of unknowns about the future, about what, what's going to happen down the road. and kind of unprecedented time of maybe feeling out of control and, and unsure. And I want to present to you today just a kind of different perspective. And really, I think we're in a time where we're being called to recognize the importance of what we focus on, the importance of what we're paying attention to, and the amount of control that we have over our ability to shift our minds to really call, to focus on what, what scripture calls us to do, on what is above, on truth, on goodness, on beauty, in a time where we're really being kind of assaulted with fear, with worry. You know, God is calling us to keep our focus on him, on his goodness, on his truth, on his beauty, on his plan, especially when we don't have one on our own, that we are really called to shift to that, to really press into God's plan because the reality is that we are not alone. We are temples of the Holy Spirit. Our lives, as scripture said in the Easter Sunday readings, our lives are hidden with Christ in God. We are a new creation. We are one with him. And so in a, in a really real way, as we are being quarantined, as we are kind of feeling alone, I know God is calling us to become aware of his presence with us personally in a way that we maybe before this time have never really been really inclined to really do to begin to see and experience his presence in a new way because the truth is whenever we're alone we're never really alone we have three other persons with us at all time it's father son and holy spirit the holy trinity with us and i know that in these times of suffering our, the scripture comes alive that god is close to the brokenhearted and my prayer for you that if you're one of those sisters out there who is really suffering and struggling right now in the the challenges we're facing through this whole coronavirus situation my prayer is that your attention will begin to shift to god's presence with you to his words of peace to scripture and the way that he wants it to come alive in a new way in your heart as he draws close to you and he calls you to draw close to him during this time and experience the power of his life giving presence of the new life that he wants to bring to you so my prayers my prayers are with you and for you and just have a beautiful, happy Easter season. God bless you.